What is up everybody? How are you guys doing today? Welcome back to another Horror Talk. On today's Horror Talk, we are going to be going over the newly released The Nun trailer. Let's check it out. Now, if you're un sure what the nun is it's not a spinoff of the exorcist it's actually a spinoff of the conjuring or the conjuring 2 pretty much at the end of the conjuring 2 there was this sort of marvel-esque stinger that they put in there and pretty much the only thing anybody ever talked about with the conjuring 2 i'll get to that point a little bit later um they showed this sort of like a short teaser trailer stinger uh, at the end of The Conjuring 2 and it hyped everybody up. So then they said, yeah, we're gonna do a nun movie. And so here is the trailer. We're gonna check it out and then come back and I'm gonna talk all about it. So stay tuned, enjoy. <laughs> pray for forgiveness yeah that was uh that was something mm. um i like the music in it I'll, I'll give them that the music was good the location wise it seemed like a decent location for this type of movie um, dark corridors looks like an old type of 19th century church type of thing um the outfits it has enough creepiness there that I, I kind of enjoy some of it. Uh, it just didn't look like what I expected. And the fact that they didn't introduce any of the characters that we've seen from The Conjuring, you know, uh, the Warrens, uh, they didn't show them at all in this trailer. I'm sure they will show them in, you know, more trailers to be released in time. But this one, they did not make an appearance at all. Um, they even showed us like the a snippet of the last couple seconds from The Conjuring 2. Um, and even they make a point, and I, I'm kind of done with this whole Conjuring universe because they keep bringing up the other stuff. And I understand it's a Conjuring universe, but down the line, it's not gonna be like the Avengers universe where you have all the characters meet up. Uh, are we gonna get Ed and Lorraine Warren uh, fight against all of these creatures, the nun, Annabelle, all in one movie? If they're gonna go that route, then sure. Then, then by any means, keep going this way. But um, this whole like throwing it at us, you know, before The Conjuring, before Annabelle, <laughs> it just seems kind of like a marketing ploy that I'm not really, a big fan of if, if this movie is called the nun not the conjuring the nun it should stand on its own like just have no relation really to the other movies and if people see it and they say oh that's the same character i think that's a far better way to enjoy this film and the way they did 
with Annabelle and The Conjuring, I enjoyed that aspect of showing it in the beginning and it still sort of having a relationship to the characters in The Conjuring, but not pretty much being a stinger. And that was cool. If we never got another Annabelle movie, it was still really good and better directed and better in my opinion than the actual Annabelle movie itself. There's even another Annabelle movie coming out. I don't know why per se. Um, I haven't really seen Annabelle uh, creation yet. It's on my DVR, but I plan to watch it soon. Uh, but I heard really good things about that because it's David F. Sandberg behind it. Um, he did Lights Out, which was pretty good. And that brings me to the director on this movie. This is only his second film. He did The Hollow. Its name is uh, Corn Hardy. So not quite sure if that's a smart decision to bring someone with little talent or a little experience to something like this where they're trying to get it to be a, just as big as the other Conjuring movies. But just my thoughts. What are your thoughts on the trailer? Leave them down below. Leave a comment. Leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And thank you guys for tuning in. Thank you guys for all the support. Also, make sure to check out Awkward R6. Uh, he did a trailer reaction to this uh, Conjuring, and I'm sure he probably liked it a bit more. And uh, let him know I sent you if you did. So anyway, that has been it. Goodbye, good afternoon, good night, adios.